Hey, what's up, what's up, Wasabi? Welcome to another episode of Eric Meal Time. Tonight we're at the Fuji Supermarket. I'm with uh, the wife and boys. We're going to be having a home meal. We're not gonna be doing much cooking this evening, but we're gonna buy a bunch of ready-to-eat foods, maybe some light cooking, and uh, yeah, whatever, it'll be interesting. Let's see what we can come up with. I know the boys are hungry. We're staying at an Airbnb, my friend Kevin's place. And there'll be a link to the Airbnb down below as well, too. These apples right here are the best, by the way. Nice transition into food, huh? It's called jazz apples from New Zealand. I mean, they're tiny, but they are really the best. They taste the best. We make apple pie. And then for the kiwis, there's two types. These are the green ones. And these are the, they're called sun gold kiwi. So the place we're staying has got a full kitchen, which is nice. You'll definitely be able to cut these. You guys ever seen a Japanese sweet potato? These things are awesome. This is what burdock root looks like, gobo root. I always talk about this a lot in my videos, and, but it's always all processed already. You can buy it already, you know, cut and processed too. Let's go find the crew. I, I don't know where these guys are at. Probably the ready to eat foods. They're hungry. Oh, here, I knew this guy. Hey, look, it's Mega Brain 6100, yo. What do we got so far? Oh, God, this is going to be expensive. <laughs> he goes right for the chew total. Oh, my God. 10 bucks, that's reasonable. Yeah. Salmon is good, there's octopus. Okay, it's gonna be a sashimi apati. Good job, Mr. Where'd you get that shirt? That's, I don't really like Coca-Cola, but that's a good, <laughs> that's a really cool uh, shirt. Yeah. Oh, and look here, we have the dudes. I got it. What's up, guys? Welcome back to uh, J-Land. It's nice to be back. Are you a Berg? Yes, I am a Berg. I'm a that's proud cool. Berg. I want to take you to this show. This shop is a, uh, it's a restaurant. Shinjuku. Restaurant bar. It's in, yeah, Shinjuku. Shinjuku. And it's a German sausage, and uh, they have different kinds of beer. It's pretty cool. I'm, I'm starving. Hey, there's taco kits. Could do our own tacos. Oh, wait, they sell tortillas. It's in taco Japan kit. Now? It's a kit. So it's got the, the spice mix and the salsa. This is pretty nice for Japan. In a, in a country supermarket, guacamole dip, cheese dip, chunky. So let's get some chips and salsa. This is my favorite boss coffee in a can. They got six packs. Ooh. It's Cafe LA. The gold one and then black, right? So that's got no sugar, no cream. This kind of stuff's really popular in Japan, just iced coffee. Just, you would just buy it like that and pour it over ice. Here's the Kit Kat section. These are in the snack packs, everybody. If you, when my meals get a perfect six rating, I put these in to get some snack packs. They're pretty good. These are pretty good, the Black Thunder. And we're gonna be playing some card games tonight, so we need some prizes, is what you call them. What's hard to find in Japan are tortilla chips without seasoning on them. Like, see, this is, it's got cheese. So we got beer supplies, wine, and oh, cocktail, so, oh boy. So if we... Oh, these are, what are these, um, what do you call these, IPAs? The trick is to figure out how to get in here. We might need a flashlight. There should be a lock box. Yeah, there's a lock box. Oh, I've seen those, those are so cool. Right? You can lock your stuff in a lock. Yeah, people use these um, in, for their cars. Yeah, it's pretty That's easy. so cool. It's pretty easy. Home. Yeah, welcome home. Ojaimashimasu. Yeah. Warning, no stupid people beyond this point, so. No. <laughs> the fart zone, oh, this is classic. Changing the toilet paper will not cause brain damage. Is it two bedrooms? This is interesting, huh? There's three beds in here. Oh, this is the There's a refrigerator. Is this it? It's, an, oh, it's a dishwasher. Dish All right, Kevin, where's the refrigerator? Is this the boys' room? Yep, okay, I gotta fill this out. But yeah, I mean, look, it looks definitely lived in. Look at the collection of books, man. This is great. Yeah, it's a nice place. It's cozy for sure. It used to be an English school, so this is a nice little bar. I like it. So there's no refrigerator. We're gonna go buy ice, which is fine. This is no big deal. We just assumed there would be a refrigerator in Airbnb, but that's cool. Just walk it. Oh. And we need whipped cream because we got this cool game where you get creamed. Yeah, that'll be that'll be later. We are a family that likes to play games and I'm only seeing books here. Lots of books. Oh, here we go. He's got games. Yeah, Pictionary Scrabble. Mm-hmm. Connect four. Yeah, it's some good stuff. Cat in the hat, hello. He's got a lot of games. Yeah, we're not gonna be bored, that's for sure. Let's do a kampai. Ready? You ever a drink for you? I'm having a, this is an IPA, which is pretty rare. It's a Kirin IPA. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, that's good. Mmm. Not bad at all. 
<laughs> Look at that. Oh, that's Wagyu right there, baby. Some kimchi. This is the sauce for the meat. That's, is that ton? Yeah, good stuff. Okay, so the first course is not sashimi. It's Wagyu. That's mine. Right? I'm being joined by... That's right. Oh, that's good. Wow. The best meal I've had in a long time. Super tender. Right? Yeah. God, this is amazing. Well, it's nice to have kimchi with me. That, you know, is the way that it really works for Korean yakiniko. So solid, if you will. And kimchi is different every time, right? Yeah. Every time you eat kimchi, it's different. Wow. Uh, yeah, come on, just come on in there. What's up, guys? So, oh, man, welcome it. to the party. The, the fiesta. Starting off with meat dishes. Uh, and then we've got sashimi later. Lots of different types of sashimi. Uh -huh. but, yeah, we wanted to get the cooking done early, I guess, first. We have some wasabi too we could put on this. No. No? No. No wasabi on meat? No. Not no. happening, huh? No, 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 no. Are you, sauce or no sauce, boss? I would do sauce. On the arm? On your arm? Equally good. Amazing. This is even better. It's more steak. Nice steak. Mm-hmm. Mm, amazing. Wow. It's really good quality. Oh my goodness. I'm not worthy. Oily. If you guys get a chance to try Wagyu, Japanese beef, it's just... It melts. It melts in your mouth. Mm -hmm. It's just, it's fabulous. I love it. Can't get enough of it. What? Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is way better than this one. But they're both good, you know? Mm, pretty good. Yeah. So, meat for appetizer? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Come on in a little closer. You might be cutting yourself out. Not really sure. You can't tell. The kimchi is, um, uh, it's chilled. I like that. It's way better than the it's kimchi. It's different. It's way better than the kimchi they have in California. Yeah? Way better. Really? I think I like kimchi that's sold in Japan. It's more, it's not as spicy. Mm. It tastes a little more sweeter. This is, a, this is a sweet one. I, I'm yeah, tasting I, like my, sugar, yeah. It's a little sweeter in my opinion. But they're all like it. But every kimchi is different, too. You never get the same exact thing. It doesn't, same, mm -hmm. doesn't taste the exact same. Mm. Cause I think the flavor changes, like, the longer you, you let it sit, like, the flavor changes. Mm. So it's never the same. Okay. Connect for yo. Well, it's your first time playing this game, right? Yeah. Okay. This is the funnest part is this. Yeah. That's the best part. Yeah, and... <laughs> I'm back. Back in the game. Already you got three on the bottom? Stop you. Oh! <laughs> Alright, let's try, let's play a different game. I'm tired of this. What we got going on here tonight is make your own Kai Sendon. And can you explain what Kai Sendon is? Kai Sendon? Yeah. It's, it has fish. Fish. I don't know what's in this. Yeah, lots of different yeah. kinds of raw fish over rice. So basically, this is your rice, and then you just Pick what you want. There's some different salad items, right? And uh, yeah, fish. So we've got chutoro, we've got octopus, we've got Thai, negi toro. What's over on yours? Salmon, eggs, cucumber, and hokkigai salad. So it's um. Is that um, like a? It's like a marinade. It's like mayo marinated. Is there fish in that, it's, or is it no a potato? Fish. It's there's fish in it. There's fish in it. Okay, yeah, yeah. of course. Yeah. It's oyster. Oyster salad. <clears throat> okay, and then of course more kimchi. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's do it. I'm gonna come over there and join you guys. Yeah. For me, see, this is a lot. That's a lot of rice right there. And it's just like you just don't know how to eat rice with fish. And I guess the trick to this is to do it really not. You got to make it look attractive, right? Would you say that's yeah. The t yeah. To make it spread that over the rice so that it looks good. You want to hide the rice underneath. See, maybe he's not very hungry because you can see the rice. That's a pretty good job. Yeah, but we had the meat already. You haven't had any meat yet, or did you? I had a little bit of meat. You guys were just <clears throat> so hungry, you just devoured Oh, we just devoured them, and Mama got so mad. All right, you guys go ahead and eat first. 
while I build mine. Oh, me incoming. This was wasabi. This wasabi. wasabi. So it's pretty cool that I get the supermarket how you can buy this stuff and put together your own kaisendon. This is a great idea. Whose idea was this? My idea. Great idea. Mm. Great idea. Good diet. Good diet. Yeah, they're just going to eat like... Good diet. Yeah. Mm. They're going to go hard. Go hard or go home. Take your time, guys, because we have all night. I'm so hungry. Do, do you want to describe any of the, the foods? Which mm. ones you like, which ones you don't? The negi toro I don't really care for, but... Really? I don't know. It's hard it's to... It's the goodness, man. It's so good. Mmm. Mmm. But... Fishy goodness. Fishy goodness. Fishy goodness. Okay, that's... Mm -hmm. That's a start. It's fishy goodness, What do you man. think? Fishy goodness. Mm-hmm. I like it. It's like... It's like you're eating sushi, but like on a bigger scale. Mm. There's this, oh, this, there's vegetables, cucumbers in here too, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay. What do you think? I like the salmon. You like the salmon, yeah. The salmon, uh, you can tell the texture of the salmon. It's uh, the fatty, fatty style? The belly. The belly, yeah. The belly get, like, the here, I mean, that, that's the salmon. It's like, oh, you know that's going to be good. Uh, did you guys put um, wasabi? Or, mm -hmm. I mean, or I'm show not. you? Did you show you it up at least? Mm -hmm. What is this This one? Come up, Michael? Eggs. Oh, eggs. Sweet eggs. Sweet eggs, okay. Brilliant. Okay, so here's what I came up with. That's my creation. How'd I do? Did I hide all the rice? Mm. I don't know. You poured show you just over the top of it? Mm hmm. Okay. I will do the same. Dump it on? Yeah. Dump it on evenly. Okay. And wasabi, same thing? Mm-hmm. Dump it on evenly. It's so good. It's nice that when you buy um, fish in the supermarket that you get these little wasabi packs. Right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. Wasabi packets. Right, wasabi packets, yeah. I can almost put these in to get some snack packs, but... They need to be refrigerated, so that's not gonna work, right? No. Yeah, they're all. Just... But they do have wasabi in these little tubes, right? Mm -hmm. You've seen those, right? Yeah, the tube wasabi. Yeah, those and, that, and, all, and those don't have to be refrigerated until after you open them, right? Mm -hmm. So that's it's like going, mayonnaise. So that's going on. The two tuna <laughs> is a very expensive one, right? The fatty the tuna. Fatty part of the tuna, fatty tuna yeah. which they don't, you don't get a lot of. Yeah. It's the... Is it the belly? Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right. Going in for my first bite, and these guys are almost done. Mm. Yeah. I'm so good. I'm so, so hungry. Hot. I'm gonna, gotta make it perfect, though. Wasabi on that last bit of fish. You can put more wasabi on the chutoto, actually, right? It somehow, um... The oiliness of the fish mm -hmm. really kills nice. the spiciness of the wasabi. Yes. Well, I like the steak better. Eat <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it with the kimchi. Put too much wasabi on it, bro. It's a seafood mm -hmm. salad with mayonnaise. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's so, so good. Okay, I'm going in for salmon now. Because Mega Brain said you like the salmon. The salmon is better than the chew total. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Rush, rush, rush. No? That's good. Do you miss this kind of food since mm -hmm. you've been away from America? Yes, I, I mean, do. been away from Japan in mm -hmm. America. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's so good. It's like you, you can't get, get a kaisen don't like this in America. You can get it for like thirty bucks. I'm not willing to pay thirty bucks. Thirty bucks? No, it's expensive. All right, so there's this gag that I use with my students all the time, and this is how it works. So you know, people wear jeans with holes in them all over the place. 
that's not something I particularly really care for as a fashion statement. So whenever one of my students shows up or my wife, <laughs> whoever, in my life, I always say, where did, where did you fall? Are, are you okay? Yeah, are you bleeding? Do you need a Band-Aid? And it just it just goes on and on. Oh, both legs. You have... Oh, are you... Where, where, where did this happen? Are you going to be okay? Stop. Stop. And it always gets a laugh. It always gets a laugh. Let's go. Chuckle. The first time, it yeah, it's, it's a chuckle. Sometimes it's a really heavy laugh. This is it the only problem? And then, and then here's the kicker. It's an on... It's a running gag. So I do it over and over and over in my classes because every class, there's always somebody that has a hole in their jeans. You know, it's the rules of three. After the third time, it's not funny anymore. <laughs> After the third time, no. it gets more funny. Progressively funny. No, 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 no. Yeah. No, 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 no. What do you guys think? Uh, do you have a hole in your jeans? Uh, Are you okay? Uh, uh, <laughs> I don't know. That's so good. But also, it's called, in, in Japanese, it's called Oyaji Gaga. Oyaji Gaga. Which means, if dad you're... Joke. It means a dad In your 50s, yeah. It's a dad your dad, joke. Yeah. It's a dad joke. And you're allowed to get away with a certain amount of that kind of stuff. Well, he's way over that amount. But, yeah. Okay. Not enough about that. Oh, I like the egg. I can't believe we bought all this at the supermarket. I noticed when Japanese people eat sashimi sushi, you can see like a smile on their face. They're just, it's something special. Mm. Right? It is. It's not like a bowl of ramen. It's not like a you know like a like curry, mm -hmm. right? Sushi, sashimi. Like sushi. It's it's yeah. There's something really special about it. And people recognize it. Yeah. No exception tonight, mm -hmm. right? Mm, good. Mm. So, why don't we just go ahead and rate this one, you guys? Uh, you guys are done. Okay. Yeah. This one. I, I give it a six out of six. Six out of six. Down. Like, I miss this kind of food. It's like homemade food, fish. Like, I can't complain, honestly. I can't ask for anything else. Beer. It's got everything, man. Yeah. It was a good meal. Good idea, man. It's a good meal. Six. And we're staying at Kevin's guest house. Mm -hmm. And it feels like we're on a trip, mm -hmm. even though it's 20 minutes from our house. <laughs> yeah. But, you know, maybe. We just went over to the next city mm -hmm. and went to their supermarket and then checked in here. Yeah, it's um, like close getaway. Yeah, I mean, it feels like we're in a. It's got a foreign feel to. I mean, it's all it's very English friendly. It is. Right. It is. Rustic. Rustic. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay. And what about you? Where are you gonna go? I'll give it five. Five out of six. Okay. Any comments? Mm. It was good. <coughs> okay. Not good, enough, not good enough for six. <laughs> yeah. Really? <laughs> really? Well, I get number six. Okay. Strict with his ratings. What about that? Do you remember the steak we had in the beginning? Yeah. I got to count that. Uh, did, yeah, that counts too. Then it's a six. Oh, see, that's what I thought. <laughs> that meat yeah. bumps it up to. You six. forgot about that. Yeah. Yeah, Wagyu is just amazing. I think I'm gonna have to go. See, I can't finish the rice. See, these guys, it's they're half Japanese. See, yeah. it, it's a cultural thing. No. I've never been able to eat a lot of rice. But it's just like a hamburger. I can just slaughter. It's just Westerners don't know how to eat rice and fish or like rice with something. Like Japan, Asian people know how to eat rice with something. It's just not part of your guys' culture. So you mean I eat the fish by itself? That's yeah. why I have this leftover. Yeah, you don't oh. know. There's like this system called the okazu, okazu and rice system. We balance out how much rice we eat depending on how much fish we have. So we always balance it out. Okazu. Okazu. You learn something new every day. Yeah. Okazu. Yes. Anything can be okazu. Okay, let me try okazu. So this can be okazu, <laughs> that can be okazu, this can be... Oh, kimchi, just, kimchi, kimchi too? Kimchi can be. Oh. Anything that goes at rice can be okazu. You just oh, have so to balance it out. It doesn't out. have to be complicated. Yeah. You just okay. have to balance how much rice you eat with how much meat you eat. Nah. I'm not feeling it. <laughs> yeah. Because I'm saying, what, like, just people, Westerners don't know how to do it. Asians know how to do it. Okay. It's a cultural thing. We're not going, you Asian people. I guess that leaves me to rate this meal. I, I think it was six, because I usually don't find great things at the supermarket like we did tonight. It was, a, it was a group effort. Kevin's Airbnb, what do you guys think so far? 
pretty cool, right? It's like, it's kind of weird because it's like a Japanese architectural house, but there's, it's filled with like American furniture. There you go. Yeah, it's good weird. point. Good point. And lots of, you know, like posters and like pictures. Yeah, it's and like, it's kind of like? weird. Trinkets, yeah. antiques almost, right? A lot of books. I mean, this he used to use this place as an English teaching school. Teaching school, yeah. It's a Japanese home Tom. furnished with like American furniture. It's kind of weird. Yeah, we can, it's a little bit weird, but it's yeah. cool. I, but I feel pretty you know, comfortable here. He's got a little bar here, and there's two separate bedrooms, and it's it be all right. So there was two sixes and a five, or six. Six. Five, I think I think you went six after we you revised your rating. Yeah, so six. six. So yeah, three sixes. That's uh, let's get some snack packs. Yep, and we're giving away three of them. Yep. So the only thing you guys need to do is go over to the dude's got it, his channel, and go over to Mega Brain 6100's channel and comment on their latest video. Okay, on my video, you can comment as if you like too. That's fine, but that's not going to help you for the contest. For the contest, you got to comment on one of their their latest video. And I will be checking the comments over there. And I'll choose, this is a double giveaway. I'm gonna choose three winners from each of their channels. So six people total? Yeah, so you guys really need to start cranking out videos like Content. and have a lot of stuff, have some good stuff. Content. But whatever, the let's just say like the latest two or three videos, the latest three videos on each of their channels, okay? <clears throat> you can comment on those. Those would be the ones that be entered like for, for your chance to win. That, that's pretty fair, right? Yeah. Right. Okay. So there's links to their channels up either in the cards, which is up above my head, or down below in the video description. And would you guys like to talk about the competition, how it's going so far? Uh, this guy's winning by like a thousand subscribers. So if you want to help this dude out over here, that'd be great. Unsubscribe to his channel. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> kind of stuff, so it's good. Yeah. Okay. So there you go. Would you like to say anything? More, more magic on your channel, right? Yeah. <laughs> Lots of magic, yeah. He's going. And are you going to be doing a magic trick tonight? We're going to do another film episode. Well, that's that's separate. You guys don't need to know about that. But it'll be on his channel. Yeah. You're working on that. It's the scarf through the cell phone. That's the trick, right? Yeah. It's amazing. Okay, so that's going to do it for this one. I look forward to reading your comments over on their channels. Also on, on this video as well, too. And thank you guys for watching. We will see you in the next one. Deuces, guys. Dark Surf 6. Mega 6100 and the dude's got it out. We're playing, it's a drinking game. And how does it work? It, we don't know if it works. This is the first time. <laughs> yeah, so you get it, you get down here, put yeah, your face okay. in, put your face in, your chin goes on the thing. <laughs> and then you push the button. Uh, somebody's gonna get cream. Wait, 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 you gotta say, I got, I'm gonna I'm be the judge of this. And I'm gonna say when you guys are gonna start. But to, to tilt it down a little bit, please. Good? Nope. How much more? There? Nope. <laughs> <Sorry>? <laughs> you said tilt it down! You said tilt it tilt down! It back up! You said down! I'm... <laughs> down a little bit. Down? <laughs> up a little bit? <laughs> get, your, get your face in there, Charlie. Are you good? Yeah. Well, I don't know if they can see this or not. <laughs> Let's go down just a tiny bit. Okay, yeah, that's good. All right. Yes, you can. Yeah, that's good. All right, three, two, one, go! Hit the body, go, 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 go! I hate this game. That's <laughs> good. All right, this is drinking game. Round two. Hi. This is drinking game round two. You push the button, and then like whoever pushes the button the fastest makes it go towards the other guy. And then when, when it gets all the way to the rad, it goes in your face. Okay, ready? <laughs> and go! This <laughs> 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 sucks, man. It's the stupidest game ever. So this is pretty good. <laughs> Thank you, Kevin's Guest House. It was a great stay. We really enjoyed it. We didn't get to play basketball, but uh, that's all right. 
Yeah, good times. That was fun. Did you guys have fun? Ready for some really bad one-liners? Here we go. Watch out for the clip. Watch out for the close. Watch out for all the great links on the screen. Go ahead, click around. Party on, team. Get some.